pounds. This is your reading for July. Okay. <clears throat> Makes the card. So whoever needs to hear the message the most, I hope the cards all give you some meaningful insights. So, Libras, Libras. Main card. Your card, the outside energy, what you need to do, and the last one. <clears throat> okay, so the main card, Libras, we have two of staff possibilities or wants. Your card, your energy is the dream. Six of Cups. Mm. The outside energy we have Eight of Swords, Guilt. What do you need to do? The King of Staff, the Creator, and the last one. Again, choices. Schizophrenia, Two of Choice, Two of Swords. So, um, you're kind of at, at a crossroads, some of you guys. You're at a crossroads and um, you need to take action and you need to make a choice, a decision. You need to um, start something. But on, on the outside, you're confronted with this energy, this Eight of Swords. Like, things are not looking great. You you feel like it's no... Um, how to say it? That there's nothing good coming. That is not... That is kind of hopeless or... Yeah, like you see no way out or no, um, you seem stuck. You feel like things are stuck. You can't move. You can't see anything good. You can't. So from, from the outside, it looks like it's all hopeless, but it's really not. It's just a matter of attitude. Your card here, the... Six of Cups, the dream, you're reminiscing on reminiscing <laughs> on the past. You are um, you're caught up somehow in how it was or in this sort of regret and um maybe you wish things were like they were before um okay so i yeah so you're confronted with something that seems so bleak and hopeless and you kind of want to go back to how it was before but the, actually the universe is pushing you forward and despite this like hopelessness that you may perceive from outside or this like there's no way out something like this there's no way to get rid of something or there's no way to win with something or this that you don't see any breakthrough um that's it's not as bad as it looks i mean it, it, in some ways it is like you do have to deal with some 
things, but it's not all hopeless. It's not, uh, you're not gonna be stuck there. It's just how things look like at this moment, but it's not at all a dead end. It's actually, as I said, the universe is pushing you forward. And you do have to make a decision and you, you do have to get rid of this confusion, of this indecision and this... You, 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 think, you have difficulties in moving on. You have difficulties in actually taking matter into your own hands and uh, start this thing yourself and have trust in your capabilities and have trust in yourself um, yeah so whatever it is if you're facing a difficulty right now and it makes you feel like it's hopeless and like there's no hope no how to say no, no breakthrough no way of getting away from it, from it or you, f it, you feel stuck and if you keep your mind instead of focusing on what you can do now your mind keeps kind of want to escape and keep feel sorry for how things were and it's kind of this you feeling defeated you're feeling you would rather just feel sorry for yourself then then get up and fight and start new so that's it your challenge is to make the decision and take action and start new and rely on yourself and have faith and confidence that it will be okay and whatever it is that you're presented with <clears throat> it won't be like this uh, forever. This is just a, an obstacle or a test that you have to pass because, as I said, like the universe is trying to get you to move forward and overcome some barriers you have. So there's no point in thinking on of how it was, of how nice it was, of how you wish it you it go back to how it was. There's no point in getting stuck in that because you're not you're stagnant you're just you're not doing yourself any good you have to make a decision and you have to move forward and you have to face this whatever obstacles don't let them discourage you because it's not it's it's not as dark as you may see it it's not as hopeless as you may see it it's not it's not at all is as I said, it's a, it's an um, opportunity for you right now to overcome something within you, to uh, challenge yourself and go higher, and have. It's all about having trust and faith in yourself, and not feeling, not allowing yourself to feel hopeless. Not allowing yourself to to be lost in this illusion that it's like you can't get a breakthrough, like you can't get away from this because you can. There is hope. You just you're not seeing it right now because you're kind of stuck in um, being feeling sorry for how things were, and you know feeling. Like, it's hard for you to fight because you feel like, ah, it's lost or I can't get that back or I can't, it can't be like that. But yes, you can and things can get much better, but you have to overcome this mentality and you have to face whatever is it that you're facing right now. You have whatever challenges you're facing, you have to go through them and you have to trust yourself. There's no other option for you, you have to move forward. You have to go higher, move forward and trust yourself and it will be okay. 
so yeah this is what I see for some of you Libras I hope this makes sense for whoever resonated with this and if you didn't it's okay maybe this wasn't for you if you didn't maybe next time thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later